Hi YouTube. I'm going to bring you a quick video to show my length check. I have not checked my length um, since the summer. So it's been about six months since I checked my length. And during the summer, it was around the June time frame, my last length check, the longest parts were about eight inches. So today, I'm going to do a quick length check. Um, at the end of next month, I'll do a more thorough length check because that will be my two-year anniversary for being natural. My last perm I had was June 17, 2010, and I actually did my big chop um, 10 months later, April 30, 2011. And so now I've been natural for a year and 10 months and absolutely loving it. Can't see myself getting another perm. Um, so I'll just explain to you my hair right now. This is, um, blow dried. Um, it was blow dried like a couple of weeks ago for a hairstyle that I did. And every day to go to work, I've just been combing it back in a, a ponytail. So it's been blow dried, stretched. So I'm going to start with the length check and I just have a, a regular, um, measuring tape to do it. So, on the side, I need to trim my ends. Wrong side. So that's about eleven inches. This part may not be as long. That's another 11 inches. Like that's a little part is almost eleven. No more than eleven inches there.
a little piece, a little bit over 12 inches. It's 11 inches. inches, 12 inches. Mm, a little 11 inches. So, I guess it's safe to say most of my hair is 11 to 12 inches and it has grown quite a bit because some areas on my sides and in the front it was only three inches when I actually did my BC actually here in the front so I'll do that quickly okay. Here in the front, it was three inches when I first did my BC, which was a year and 10 months ago. So a year and 10 months, it's grown seven inches here in the front. I know I have a lot of breakage with the hair here in the front because I wear my hair in ponytails a lot. So where the ponytail grabs it in the back, it's a lot of broken and split ends. So um, kind of robs me of my length. Those that are going natural or thinking about going natural, my advice would be to be patient enjoy the journey and enjoy every stage your hair is at from the teeny weeny afro to the big hair enjoy every stage because I most certainly have and it's things that I used to do with my hair that was shorter I can't do with my hair at this length so I just try to embrace the moment and I'm constantly watching YouTube learning a lot um, how to treat my hair how to style my hair and everything like that so anyway, well, thanks for watching and again, stay encouraged on your natural journey and I hope you have a pleasant one. Please subscribe, click like, leave a comment, some advice. I'd love to hear from you. Thank you.